Hi, it's Therese and I'm here for all to new today. I'm going to be stamping a very clean and simple masculine card and I'm using this bottle full of set and I just love the fonts in this set. I love that some of them have sort of a filled in center of the words. It's a really, really fun font. So I'm working on my card front and just stamped out the outline bottle with some dark chocolate crisp ink. It's one of the Alter New inks and they work really well with Prismacolor pencils. And what I'm doing now is just adding my colors. I'm literally just coloring my pencils directly onto the front of the bottle. I use heaps of colors. I added lots of layers. I blended it with my Gamsol in between until I was happy sort of with the look that I was going for. So what I'm gonna do now is leave you with the coloring. If you do wanna know the names of the colors that I use, they're listed over at my blog and the link will be in the YouTube description below. But for now, I'll leave you with the colouring and I'll be back when, well, when it's almost done. So I wanted to add a little bit of shadow to make it look like I had some bubbles of water on the outside of the bottle. You know when a bottle's cold, you get those water bubbles on the outside? I was trying to recreate that and <laughs> it kind of didn't really work very well, but I'll show you how I fix it in the end. But for now, I'm adding some shadows. I'm adding some bubbles out the top of the bottle. And then I decided to use my white gel pen and I'm 
kind of not really happy with that how that turned out but I'll get back to that in a minute all right so I've created my own BG 11 cardstock here and I'm doing a stamp out a speech bubble so I don't actually have a speech bubble that will fit this very well but this is actually one of the sentiments I was telling you about awesome fun font great for masculine design and this stamp set has these um, sort of bottle labels as well so what I've done here is actually just masked off a little section of the label stamped it out with some black ink and then fussy cutting it directly right up to where the um, ink was stamped and just to make it look like I've cut it out perfectly I'm adding some a black marker around the edge of that I decided to make the bubbles that came out of the top of the bottle uh, sparkly so I've got my quickie glue pen and adding some really fine Prisma glitter to that and it was um, as simple as just adding a couple of foam squares behind the sentiment and like I said I wasn't happy with those white the white bubbles on the outside of the bottle so what I decided to do was um, get rid of them and that was easy easier than I thought actually I simply just used my blending um, stump and rubbed them off added a little bit more pencil and then decided to go with the glossy accents instead so I add a few of these to the card when, when you add the glossy accents it does kind of look like um, the glue's opaque when it's wet but just to be aware that once it does dry it will dry clear and be rock solid too I love this stuff so that's pretty much it for my card today thanks for joining me I'll be back again real soon till next time happy paper crafting bye